Well, welcome back to Rainwell uh, Animal World. Hollow Animal. Uh, Castle Well. Wellvania. Um, I. It is much later in the day. It is. As, been almost 12 hours since I was playing because I uh, had to be a dad and stuff, and that's a good thing. But I have been watching my recordings because it's the only thing. <laughs> I can't play the game. I can't record the game, right? But I can watch the videos and I can pay attention to things and I can take notes. So that's what I did. And I, I figured out what I, I think I figured out a bunch of stuff. For one, I watched and I time stamped a bunch of videos for all the locations on the map for the different. Um, the different little stamp icons and numbers, and so I uh, I know where these things are now for a lot well a lot of them. So hold on a second here. I got uh, I got go this one. That's grid five. Oh, that's the wrong one. This is grid, and it's five. And I believe I have a pretty good understanding of what these things mean now. Uh, also from sort of like looking at stuff. So you have uh, different symbols, right? Oops. You have different symbols, and you have uh, different numbers for each one. And you might be like, okay, well, I gotta, like, stamp the rooms or something, or I gotta find all, like, let's say, like, all five fire icons. But how does that actually help you, like, turn that into a song? Which is what I assume it's for, right? Like, you would want to take this stuff and turn it into a song. Because um, I don't think stamping on the map would necessarily do anything, because the game's been pretty good about, like, locations are important. Um, like, you do things in a specific location. You don't just do something anywhere and, like, the, the, the reaction is always immediate. So, instead, what I'll bring your attention to is that there are eight stamps. And so, therefore, I believe it's the numbers that are the important part, where I find all of the ones of a given number, and then the this is one, this is two, this is three, this is four, this is blah, 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 which has been established on the peacock clock thing. Peacock, like, where I got the animal flute is the, um, uh, like, it, like, each direction on the flute, every note has a number corresponding to it. So, the numbers aren't, like, what note I'm supposed to play for that icon, it's what set of those symbols are supposed to go together, and then the symbols, I believe, are the notes that I have to play. Um, also, a couple of fun things. One, I believe I understand what to do. Oh, oh yeah, also, I watched the, the video. I watched myself run past this with the ultra uh, ultraviolet light on, like, three times before I found it, which is incredible. Uh, it's it's funny. Like, I was just so hyper-fixated on other stuff at the time. We're looking at the rest of the room. I didn't even notice the thing that was, like, plainly in front of me. So, um, one thing that I also found of interest, um, or I believe that I understand now, is... I use the UV light here, right? And I see these things, and we got we got low, we got middle, we got high. We have these notes now. So we've got, let's say if this is if the one is one, right? So we've got four, two, one from low to middle to high. Well, um, as luck would have it, there's actually something fairly nearby that seems to correspond to that pattern, um, and it even is somewhat telegraphed based on the color scheme. And this game has been very good about that, so I have no reason to, to believe this isn't like a good indicator here, which is. The fucking penguins right here. Low, middle, high. And then that would be like the fish uh, the the uh, in the water area with the fish mural that had the arrows. It would be kind of like that where it would open up some secret maybe for these. So um, I go the flute here and so we've got high, low, middle, which would be right, down, left, down, right. Right, down, left, down, right. Okay, that didn't do anything. Right, down left, down right. Well, all right, I tried. Uh, it, I mean, it seemed like a pretty good guess, right? Like, this thing is, these guys are green. Some green pangus. I mean, now they're purple, but we got some green pangus, and we got the thing turns green when you look at it, and it does the low, middle, high thing. So, um, it could also be the, actually, it could be the other way around. Um, so, that would be... I'm just making sure I'm in my head. I'm making sure I got that. Yeah, okay. So it could be the other way around. It could be um, that this is actually like the lowest on there. Oh, because because it's a higher note. Yeah. So it'd be. Wait, 
know. So if it, but if it was high, high, low, middle, it would be. So it's not that. Um, if it was like, like the higher note, then it would be. Well, that's the normal direction. It would be high, high, low, middle. All right. Well, that one felt. I, I that one felt pretty good. The other one is that with the jellyfish song, I need to go probably use that in the same area that the jellyfish were, in the same way that like. I mean, I got the I got the the thing there. That's probably where I use it. Um, I probably well. So I I have timestamps on my videos that I was like, okay, let me grab these spots and then I can go and open up the video and pause it and be like, okay, and I can mark down this room. So um, if you'll indulge me for a moment here, I'm gonna mark a few of these things down. Uh, this one, oops. This one is the also the grid. And it is four, yeah, grid four. One, two, three, four. Okay, next one. I got a lot of them. Like, I missed a lot of these things. Also, I was started watching Barry's, Barry Kramer's stream of this game. Um, and he, I, uh, I was able to detect some stuff from watching his video. Let's see, what did I notice um, in his, um, Oh, I noticed the skull four and skull two. Also, I noticed I, I realized the mural that was like painted in the ultraviolet, uh, with the manticore, it was hatched out of an egg. And maybe that's what the incubator was about, because like the rats were all around it. Um that was just a thought I had as well. So let's see, that's question mark one. Question mark one is in the elephant room. Which is like right here. Yeah, this one. This is question oops. Question mark one. Bum, 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 bum. Right there. Next one I've got is... I seriously have like a dozen of these, or like more than a dozen. This is... Oh, I couldn't see this one right. I think it's chest. I'll have to go to it. It's uh, where it's it's in one of the dog areas. Okay, we got heart one, heart two. Heart one is... Okay, in this... Oh, shit. It's in room it's in a dark room in the dog area over here it's the dark room where you have to like lift the chain thing up uh yeah it's this one um and it is heart one heart one and then we've got heart two also i assume in the dog area because i was like watching the video yes oh it's in the room like right next to it this is heart two um, part two. At the very least, I want to record this stuff down because, like, it's significant, and I want to be able to track it down more quickly. Uh, diamond one, spiral three, fire one. Diamond one is in the room where you get the uh, the mock disc initially, which is right. Hold on, brain. Mock disc here. So this is what did I say this one was? Already forgot. Diamond one. Yeah, I see it. Diamond one is here. I mean, I don't think I like I can put it in roughly the spot. Oh, sorry, not here. Here. Diamond one. Okay, and then we've got. This is in the room with the crow. This is spiral three. Room with the crow with the ladder going down right here. I really like this map system because it's actually very easy to tell which, what each room is. Um, that sucks when it's hard. Oh, oh, you can draw with the trigger too. That's neat. Um, huh. All right, cool. Uh, stamp. Th sorry, what was this one? This was Spiral 3. Spiral 3. And then I'm literally just like, I linked myself a bunch of timestamps in one of my one of my DMs. Okay, this was in the room with all the ghosts and stuff. Oh, it's like the room right above it. Yeah, this one is Flame 2, right? Fire 1. Fire 1. Okay, got it. Fire 1. No. 
is in the room right up here. It's somewhere roughly in like the fire one. Fire one. Um, okay, I, I wasn't kidding. Let's see it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven more. Hold on. Apologies. Diamond four. <laughs> Uh, some of these might be repeats because I was just sort of like I don't didn't remember exactly which ones I got. Okay, Diamond Four is over here in it's this yeah it's this room. Uh, Diamond Four. Next one is Question Four, and then Heart Three. Ah, uh, Hour Shime. Okay, question four is in the bottom of the bubble shaft here. Do, oh shit, do these, did I link these to the same spot? Or are they in rooms like right next to each other? I might have also gotten that one already. One second. Bubble room? Oh, no I didn't. Okay, so I, I know I got hard three. Yeah, I know I got hard three. Question four is in the room to the right. Got it, yeah, yeah, yeah. So diamond, f diamond four. Or question four. Question four is in the room to the left of it. Um, question. It's like over here-ish. Four. Okay. Um, chest two and chest five are in the same room right next to each other, which is wild. Yeah, okay, so it was... It's funny, because I was even, like, on a hunt to go find these things, and I just totally skipped the fact that these were in here. Um, they're both in this room, right here. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna mark these, uh, as best I can. So this is chest two and chest five. I'm just gonna put it, like, right there, and then I'm gonna draw below it. Um, two and also five. right there um this is which one was this chest three is it's a room with spikes is that part of the water area yes it is it's when you go down to the seahorse yeah it's right here this one so this is chest what chest something chest three i suppose i didn't technically need to like record myself doing all this but at least i get to talk about my process um, yeah, it was, like, right here. Um, it's interesting. I, I was thinking about this, that, like, I'm not... I wasn't adding playtime uh, by, like, watching my recording and sort of, like, getting these notes, but I was absolute... Like, I wasn't adding to my playtime in, like, a Steam sense, but I was absolutely engaging the game, despite not actively playing it at that moment, which is sort of interesting. Uh, that's one of the things I love about puzzle games. The brain just keeps working. Okay, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. I saw this... That's question three, but question two is in the room, like, right next to it. Yeah, that's right. I was even looking around, too. Like, I was literally just so excited that I saw the other one, <laughs> and I missed that question two is, like, right next to it in this room. I'll find out what this shit's all about, and I'll be really happy that I recorded the locations for this stuff, I hope. Question two, and then I got just two more here. Uh... Skull 4? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I miss... Oh, I misunderstood that one. I tracked that as question 4. But that's actually Skull 4. Because uh, Barry's video has better fidelity on it. I'm able to see that it's a skull better. And then... Skull 2 was like... Hey, easy there. Um, okay, well, that's good. That I was tracking that. So, I know now that this one is not question mark. This is Skull. I'll probably, like, double-check these as I'm revisiting. I'm very smart. Um, that's the button I wanted. Great. Uh, oh, and then the last one was... I'm oh, sorry. What was the last one? Skull 2? Skull 2, which I... Fuck, which room was it in? Was it in that room, or was it in the next one? Oh, no, I see it. Yeah, I see it now. Okay. Skull 2 It was in another room in Dogland. It's in this room, and it's, like, right here. Skull... Two. Okay, so I got a bunch of these now. Um, 
It's also possible, like, I thought about the possibility that, like, if you look at the position of all of them, it somehow conveys information. Where, like, if you have, like, look at where Skull 2, 3, 4, and 1 are. Because I don't, I don't know if I have Skull 1. Like, that tells you something. But I really think that it's probably more, it, it feels more likely to me that it's about how... Um, you're, you don't find any duplicates of, like, number and symbol because the purpose of the symbol is actually where it is in the sequence and the number is the set that it's part of instead. So I don't know if I have a full set yet. I, uh, probably should... I'm gonna do this, like, maybe off camera. Um, I'm gonna... Com I'll compile together, like, the ones that I have so I have, like... For instance, if I look at the stamps here, I need to know... Uh, I should write down the order, at least, so it's a little bit easier for me. So, like, it goes chests... I'm drawing little pictograms here to make it easier for myself. Just chest, um, heart, skull, um, diamond, uh, spiral. Come on, fuck the pen. Just hold on. Right. Uh, fire. Just like that. Yeah, cool. And then, uh, Grid, boom, 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 good enough. And then, uh, question mark. Oh, yeah, that's, that's the eight. So, then what I can do is I can go through, I can be like, okay, I mean, shit, I, now that I already drew the little diagram, maybe I just do that now. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, and then I can, I can transcribe that into directions, so, like, I don't know, if I literally just work from what I've got so far, write this stuff down, so I've got heart, heart one. Cross out some stuff below it. Oh, I should have put this in a more open spot on this envelope I've been writing on. That's fine. Um, for one, we've got heart. Oh, and I, actually, I could also convert these into arrows. So for one, and then two, and then three, and then four. And then five. So it seems like there's five of, the, five of these sets. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and... Let's see. Does that be there? And then that be there? Yeah, based on the one. Um, that has one. We've got chests two and... Two and five. We've got... Um, heart three also has heart. We've got skull four. Oh shit, I drew the wrong fucking arrow for five. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. That should be a left arrow. Oh no, I'm, I'm sorry, that was chest. I'm stupid. I'm getting the things all mixed up. Um, skull is downwards, and that's for four. Once again, very compelling video footage. Apologize. Um, That was for that, the weird, the, the clock. That's for the, it being the teleport. Great. Um, we've got Skull 2, um, which is downward. We've got Skull 3. We've got Diamond 4. One, two, three. Yeah, okay, just make sure I'm putting the right arrows, the correct arrows. We've got Swirl 2, and that's left. Yeah, okay. Um, skull 2, Skull 3, up, yep. Tracking all those. Uh, this is also helpful because, like, it kind of shows me what areas I need to go check out again to make sure I didn't miss anything in them. Like, miss any of the, uh, these... I guess I'm going to call them pylons. Uh, flame 1... Flame one, the flame would be diagonal up left. Flame two, flame four. I didn't find a flame three again, because again, it, there's no, it, not like the symbols need to have one for every number. Um, it's more like there's five sets of these directions to do. Uh, I, I think that's that's the hypothesis. At the very least, I can encode this into this way, and it'll be something else I can use to. Um, observe the data. Swirl three. Um, diamond 
three. Diamond would be straight up. Diamond four. Question mark three. Question mark two. And question mark one. Got diamond five. Five. And then I already got flame four. And then there's got to be some in here that I just didn't notice. So, okay, what I have so far is I have two actually has six uh, movements in it. Um, what happens if it's every single one, though? What happens if it's every single note? Because <laughs> that's just a big spiral. That doesn't tell me anything. Um, and also, where do I do this? Like, where am I supposed to play this? Am I supposed to go to these things and play that note? I don't know. Actually, let me get that shot. I'm already in the room. I can see it, right? So theoretically, Swirl would be... If I was here, uh, Swirl would be uh, left. That doesn't do anything. That does jack shit. Cool. Okay, well, that's nothing then. Also, yeah, no, okay, it's the, it's the same icon. Um, I don't know. Uh, I, I think I got everything marked down now that I was tracking, and now it's time to keep doing some exploring. Uh, the other thing was I need to go back to the dark place, and I need to go do the jellyfish song, because uh, I'm pretty sure that that's where I'm supposed to do it, and then the thing will be unlocked. In fact, am I, I'm not able to get from the left there, so maybe I have to do it, like, in here. Or in here, but I, I'm gonna go check that out because I'm pretty sure that's what I gotta be doing um, with that song that I found. Uh, and I can get in there more quickly by going through. Okay, I remember through the iguana. Okay, and then I'm already here. It'd be still faster for me to do this though. There we go. Uh, go to the iguana, go right, go into the, um, the kitty area, go across the kitty area, and then I'm in the, the, uh, under the, the, like, flooded area. I can do that. I'll save. Oops. In case I die, again. You know, I hear the, I hear the kitties. The kitties. I was thinking that maybe, like, what if these were five, um, five notes? Um, uh, but, like, okay, so, again, going back to this, the position of these things is hard to decode into a meaningful value. Um, like, it's hard for me to take this information, and actually, I probably don't need to have these anymore, so I'm going to get rid of them. So I, I kind of know where everything goes. Um, and I want to have only symbols that are immediately relevant. Um, I don't know that, like, their position on the map in decodes into a... Uh, meaningful note direction. Whereas the um, the whole like one through eight thing with the fact that there's eight symbols, it kind of does. That's what makes me think like I need to look at this from a different angle. Oh wait, did I get diamond one? I didn't get diamond one. Diamond one. Cool. Um, got swirl two. Yes. Is that it? Oh, there's the last one. That's the Tamagotchi. I don't really need to mark that. I know where that is. I don't know if that's something. I can come back to it later. I know, kitties. I know. Oops. Okay. Let's go into kitty land. I would like your treasure. I know, I will save your bit, your bebés, and we will get you the treasure. Okay, so we go down here, right? And then, it was up here. No, 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 that's where the, okay. I need to go all the way to the end, got it. Oops. There we go, riding the wave. Surf's up, dudes! Okay. 
Okay, I don't actually need the bubble wand for this. So I can just go down. And then we're here. And, like, I don't suppose I do the song in here. That doesn't make any sense. Shit. Oh, well, oh, I can just get on top and jump on. That makes my life way easier. Okay, because I tried playing the song out here. I remember that I, I saw that, and that didn't do anything. UV oh, I got the UV light, so probably it wouldn't help me with this. That's not like... Oh, I used the top to get in here. Okay, so I'm back down in this place. And the jellyfish have the information on them. The color flashing is just there to look cool, I think. It's probably not red right to left, because they haven't... He hasn't done that yet. That would seem kind of strange. Um, and I'm sure I got the order right. It's, it's like up, left, down, left, down, left, down, left. So I could play it here. Okay. Oh, there's one I'm missing over there on the left. I didn't even fucking see it. Because the jellyfish song is only seven long. No wonder it didn't work. Glad I came back here. Right. It starts with right. That's why it wasn't working. Oh, hello. Oops. Uh, I mean, I guess I'll try playing it here in case, right? Because there's this is where I got the... There's a flute thing. So it's right, up, left. Okay, it's a warp. Got it. Perfect. Good to know. And then this button opens this. And it's the... Wh I'm sorry, what? Oh, it's the other side. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. So, I'm s wait, what? Why do I need another teleport? Oh, this takes me back down to here more quickly, doesn't it? Because now I can get to this without having to... Okay, cool. I, well, at least I figured out what the jellyfish song is for. It's a... But why would I need to have a... Oh, okay, got it, got it. I don't need to use the warp anymore. It did. It served its purpose. Its purpose was to open this to get me quicker access to this warp to get back to that area if I want to come in the back door more easily, I, I guess. Right? Where does D-plus spit out? Uh, it was up here, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, well that's certainly something. So that's one, one mystery solved. Um, the, I still have the Benoit's. I still don't know what to do about the peacock clock information, but I feel like it was those penguins. Okay, so there is definitely like because there's eight entries. There's something. All the all the, well all the teleports are eight entries. Um, man, I'm actually a little lost now. I was expecting kind of a little bit more to figure out. I need to know what the fuck is up with the... I need to find kitty coats. That's it. That's what I need to do. I 100% need to go around. I need to find kitty coats. So I'm going to go to... We're going to start in dog and we're... Right? Is it... There was one down here. There was one up there. And I don't feel like there's going to be... Five of them, I already looked, I, I already scanned around the whole area. I don't think there's five, there are three more jammed into that little subsection. That doesn't track in my brain. But where else would the others be? That's the part that I'm a little unsure of. I was, yeah. <laughs> um... I was hoping that I would have a little bit more insight about it. Um, hmm. That's the room where you can see that the manticore was, like, hatched out of an egg. Out of an egg. And I can't do anything in that room that I can tell. Even though it looks like that would be how I get to that one area. You know what? I... Did I, like... Did I ultraviolet through... Yeah, I did ultraviolet... I, I used the UV light in these regions, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I, I did. I went through all that stuff. Okay. And I'm pretty sure I went through this stuff here as well. Um, 
I'm gonna. Well, what do I want to do? It's a tough call. It's a very tough call. Um. I still got five more fucking eggs to find. I mean, that's one of them. I know that, and that's another one. So that's two. And then there's three more that I don't probably want up there. And I so I'm missing a power up. I looked, there's not a gold pedestal in that top left room. So which I guess makes sense because that seems to do with mechanisms. Which makes me believe Oh yeah, I was gonna check this room out to see if there's like a UV thing going on with it. So I'm gonna do that. Um let's start with that. I'm like I can take a warp to that region pretty quickly. Oops. Uh, yeah. Okay, it's across the uh, across the gap here. Get my frisbee going on. Get my frisbee going on. Get my frisbee. My frisbee. My frisbee going on. I maybe should have saved there. I guess it's fine. I can always warp. I got my warp song. Okay. So. Oh, that was. Uh, some dope. That was some gaming right there. I was not intending to pull that off quite so well, but I'm glad I did. Oh, hey, is that an Arkanoid block? It's not. It, it feels like something, though, right? Um. Okay, so this is not telling me anything. <laughs> it is, I was hoping it might tell me more, but it, it did not. Let me really inspect this idea. Let's assume... Let's assume that there is... The last power-up is related to the golden pedestals. No, that's gotta be... Well, I thought it was with the flute, but maybe it isn't. So, let's assume that I actually have everything I need to, to do this right now. I can't damage boost. Yeah, they respawn you. That's smart. Um, UV light doesn't tell me anything. Firecrackers don't do nothing. Yeah, I mean, that would be kind of weird. Can't frisbee. Can't frisbee. I don't know. I <laughs> thought maybe, is there like advanced tech here? This doesn't really help me. Like, I can't create like enough bubbles to walk on. And anyways, it wouldn't make sense to have to use a baby wand with, um, if I could spawn a chinchilla, if I could play a song to spawn a chinchilla, that would be it. That would be the play right there. Because then I would just walk the dog across. Once again, I feel as though I am missing a song in my repertoire, and I don't have any insight into where I would get that information, or what I would do with it. Oops. So I am going to come back here later, once I've got more info. Uh, screen wrap there takes me to that, which I, again, I got no fucking clue. I need kitty codes. Uh, all right, I'm going to keep looking around for kitty codes, then. Let's do it. Let's do a kitty code walkabout. Oh, kitty codes all the time. And I, I, again, I don't feel like they should be something you need the UV light for, but maybe they are. Yeah, I mean, like, maybe they just are. But also, it's kind of hard to see them with the UV light on. <laughs> so, maybe not. Um, I'm going to go to the area where I was like totally stuck and see if there's a kitty coat in there. Because maybe that'll be 
you know, a useful signal. Come on, man. Oh, wait, hold on. I want to not get crushed. No, no, no. Come back. Oh, I could also... Uh, I, not really. I was going to say, I could, like, uh, go through that gap, but not easily. Okay, and then I know that the slinky is right next to the um, remote now. So I don't have to panic. Okay. So I go in here, and, like, there's no kitty code hanging out on the wall or something. No, nothing nothing obvious with that. There's the chest. That Oh, that's a chest. I should pro probably mark the chest down on my map, so at least I know that, hey, here's another one. So that's three. There's that situation, which leads to somewhere. And there's no obvious kitty code in here either. And, yeah, the vines are in the way, so I can't do that. Oh, well, hold on a second. I could do this. A second. This may be a little cheesy, but... Oops. I don't lose any life doing this, so I might as well try to get it. Here we go. And then I could just jump across. Not quite. Could I be really sly about just running off the left? Hey, there we go. What did that do? Oh, did it open the door over here? I hit was one of the switches. Okay. So I'm not as clever as I thought I was doing that. It kind of only gets me the one. I still need two more. One's probably the right. Another one's off of the left here. And I don't know what to do about it. UV light doesn't help here. Egg. Yes, I know there's egg. That's like when I came to this room here. The gears. Like, I know there's some gear thing happening here. I know I have to do something. Uh, there's got to be... I mean, it's also possible there's like the gear song is close to where the other gear stuff is. I'm trying to think, like, where is more mechanisms? They're pretty much all down here. Yeah, they're pretty much all over here. Well, I guess there is the one over here with the dog on the treadmill for this one. Not anything at the top that I'm aware of. Eh, okay, I don't know that I did a full sweep of this region with the UV, so let's go ahead and just do that. Right? I did check that out. Yeah, yeah, I, I checked that out. Check it out again. Cool, wrong one. Um, I don't feel like doing this at the moment. Man, oh man. Uh, yeah, let's keep going right. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Dogs. That's right. Uh huh. Egg. Did I did I egg here? I apparently did or did not. Is it a top situation? No. It's oh, it's in there. I I yes, I got that one. Presumably, it was from going up this way and then going back down. Yeah, I think that's okay. That one's I've already got. Um, nothing. This. That's a switch thing, which I I can just switch also. Nothing going on with this. I mean, I'll hit the other buttons here just to see if there's something. Nope. Okay. Uh, one s remote boy, please. Oh, shit, it doesn't work here. Okay, well, that's fine. I'll go up top. Boop, boop, boop. It works here. Yes, it does. Uh, nothing in UV in here? Any of those pylons? Not seen them. Uh, nothing in here besides creepy dog statues. Um, okay, and then I was gonna do what? Oh, I guess I was gonna inspect some dog situation here, or some mechanism situation. 
Because they're, they're, I don't know, this is a mechanism area, so like, if they're, it, I don't know, it seems likely, right, that the kitty codes would all be relative to the existing mechanisms because the kitties have been locked up, like, in the mechanism area. So it's like, the location of that information would be co-located with the visual feature most related to the area they're locked in. I mean, that would be helpful. Um, I'm not seeing any, but that doesn't mean that that's not the case. Okay, so nothing here. Nothing with the UV light here. Uh, that's going to drop me down. Yep, that's fine. Looking around for kitty codes. Looking for those kitty safeties. I mean, even finding one more, I feel like, is going to give me a good amount of information. Uh, I mean, I I kind of looked around here a lot, didn't I? Guess I'll be looking some more. I also don't know what to do with the rabbit yet. Uh, the, the, the LED thing here. Except make him look mad, which is very funny. Ah, uh, big gun. I'm a sweepy boy. Oh, fuck me. I'm, I'm in contacts. I'm like, something like got in my eye. No, don't do that. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, but the contacts is worse. Oh. Why would you do this to me? Hold on. Oh, fuck me. I gotta fix this situation. I'll be right back. Oh, no! It's not like I was rubbing my eye or something. Sleep, little prince. Sleep the sleep of Benoist. Okay, let's um resume our adventures here. Oh, just the is there a pilot in here? Or uh, is there a thing? Can I remote? No, there is not. Interesting. Gotta do this one by hand. I mean, like, I've done this before, but I'll check it out again, because, hey, who knows? Maybe there's something. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, there's the hole fall down there, and then there's the thing here, which was egg. Yeah, and then, like, what was going on with this guy? I, like, I figured out that I could do the top down here, but what does that do for me? I guess it is, yeah, you know, I, I guess it is kind of a shortcut. Um, right, let's keep looking around for some kitty codes. Bone. B -b -b Bone. Okay, yeah, so there's just the one on the right. Fuck, man. Um.
I'm gonna keep looking around that area, because, like, I don't know where else I would find anything. Um, this is Ostrich Town. Ostrich Town, USA. Ostrich is gone. It's been defeated. I already dropped down there. I didn't know there's nothing down there. I think any. No, that's right. Yeah, I did a slow descent with the Ultra Pot, with the UV light. Um, Kites. Katens. Pretty sure I went through this area, both with the UV and otherwise. There was a guy up there. You know, I'm gonna go check to see if the, because there was a guy up there. Maybe there's a code up there. Not see anything anywhere else. Nope, he's just hanging. He's just chilling. I can bully him. But what if I didn't? What if I gave him a slinky? What if I did bully him though? Ow. Well, he'll bully me right back, I guess. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, that's the other giraffe statue. I didn't even realize that they were both... There's Oh, there's three of them. Okay. You know what? Hold on. I haven't played the flute in here yet. All right. I don't know what I expected to happen, but I certainly didn't expect to get speared by... Gored by a... A swordfish that one time either. Uh, let's do some echolocation. Uh, hey, first, but first, bully this fellow. <laughs> there we go. Echo location. Reveal your secrets to me. No. Okay. I mean, no. There's uh, like clearly nothing down there, because it doesn't. It like legit doesn't look like there's anything down there. The game has been pretty good about like the secret walls actually having something relevant attached to them. Uh, that is where I got the yo-yo. I don't know, would there be a secret down there? Maybe, maybe not. Got some UV. More like UP, got him. Where are those pipe, I don't know what those pipe pads are attached to. Oh, it's A and B. Okay, got it, yep. Uh, is there any intel down, I, I came down here with the lantern, but I didn't come down here with the UV, I don't think. Very pretty. Nothing, nothing obvious in the way of arrows. Same with this. Yeah. I can still use, I, I can still move these. I don't know if this would do anything for me. Like if there's some other secret set of lights to hit. That would be fucking awesome. If you do the, turn the UV light on, there's a second, there's a second set that's only visible in UV. That'd be something else, man. All right. Okay, just uh, doing my scrubbing, doing my map scrubbing here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Sorry, the kangaroo. Yes, I'm aware. Uh, sadly, this episode has been a lot of uh, sort of dead ends and rabbit trails. Um, but you know, hey, that's uh, that's show business, baby. I'm gonna check up here again. Cause like this is where I found a lot of the codes, right? This section. Oh, yeah, like no shit. Like there's a code. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, so they are probably all in this region. Which I I'm so grateful for that they're all like co-located with the kitties themselves. Like, thank fucking God. Um hold on. I'm just, you know, I don't need to write it on the map. I can just write it down on my piece of paper. Hey, my pen. Why did my pen stop? suddenly decide to stop working? There we go. Cool. Okay. I have... I feel... This is... I was saying, you know, a third piece of data would be very helpful. Third piece of data here is confirming my suspicions that uh, the other two are also going to be hiding in here somewhere as well. So, good. I will f go through here and I'll save all the kitties and then I will unlock, hopefully, I assume the third item. 
Uh, I'm just gonna keep looking around to find the other two. I'm not gonna go save the kitty yet because there's not really a reason to. Uh, I'm gonna keep looking around. There's somewhere in here that's got arrows in it that would be easy to miss. Nope. Not that I can see anyways. That soundtrack for that game is fucking awesome. Okay. If you don't know what I'm uh, badly covering, then uh, it is the uh, part of Super Castlevania 4 where it features, like, this, this thing. This, like, going up and down elevator. Or, like, having things that would crush you in the ceiling if you're uh, not careful. Or on the ground. Actually, and I think it's only ceiling. Alright, so let's go... Let's reverse this guy. Let's go back down. Whoop, almost got a squishy there. Uh, anywhere here that would be arrows. And they're not they're not UV, which is nice. They're not UV. You don't need the lantern form either. They're just about somewhere. I'm going to go ahead and guess that uh, this one spot over here where there was the... Um, yeah, big mode. Where there was the the thing is might have one. There's also I see there's a kangaroo statue up there. Huh. Uh, I I already definitely played notes in here. Oops. Right, okay. I just trying to remember where stuff is supposed to go. One. Damn it. Okay. Well, I uh, remember the strats, which is bubble to the left jump on it, and then, um, also frisbee to the left. Shit. Give myself a lot more lead time, too. There we go. That should be good, right? Yeah, I'll squeeze in. Uh-oh, uh-oh! Got it. There we go. Got he! Surprisingly, no arrows here, but that's okay. This just drops me down right here. Yep. Okay, so then I'll go into this section again and look around for some more. I mean, I guess since I'm here, I might as well free one. I wasn't planning on it, but, um... Oh, wait, hold on. Reset. Cool. Third one! So... It was there, there, one in this room. Man, it, they gotta be fucking over here somewhere. I didn't want to have to do this, but there, it might be behind all the all the mouse heads. So I will. I have to reverse the direction and go back. Yeah. Okay. Um. And I, I mean, like, I can kind of see here, so... Yeah, I did this fucking last time. God damn it! <laughs> uh, I mean, I'm 100% to blame on that one. I don't get to be that mad about it. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Hold on. Got a better idea. Don't need to punish myself that hard. I have the ability. I, I really like the that warp song. I'm really glad it exists. No arrows in here. And I need to be up here anyways, and I'm going to save now. Uh, I need to go up here so I can reverse direction. So that it's... No, no, I actually needed to be going this direction. <coughs> but then I have to take the pipe to get back down there. And I don't... I didn't mark it, so I don't remember where it is. Um, where is it? Oh, it's that guy. Yeah. I always go all the way in the wrong direction. 100% of the time, it's every time. Okay, so... And there's a little smiley face up there, which I saw previously. I don't know what that's about, but okay. He's a cool guy. He's cool and good, my friend. I realize there's a lily pad down there. Can I do anything with this? Because I know there's the big mode guy. I have the fez. 
That'd be something if he's got like if he had like some some directional input that helped. Oh. Nope. Go in the mouth. Jump in the hole. Go to the boys. Give me your soul. Alright. Now I can do this properly. And then I can throw on the lantern to see. And also just make them go away. So I'm not seeing anything, which I didn't expect to because there's the train wheels. But also, hold on, there's this big dark area right here, and it feels like... I don't know, is there a fucking chest in there? There's not. I also don't know how I get in there. Like, here would be the only way, but that's not obviously breakable, which doesn't feel correct to me. I mean, it feels incorrect that that would be a secret then. But that's totally got the space for it. Um, nothing with the... Nothing with the lantern. Uh, nothing with the UV. I'll go through this whole thing with the UV, not that it matters. Yeah. Nothing, 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 nothing. Nothing here. I'm also not seeing any pylons either. That's something else we might have Um. Yep, okay. Um, nothing there, nothing to the left. Nope. Um. Those things just crush me when they go to the left. At least I believe so. They don't crush me when I go to the right. Uh, you know what? I bet you, hold on. I'm going to reverse the, the direction of flow there for that place, and maybe there's something in there that I missed. There we go. I'm sorry, bud. I'll get you out of there. Oopsie. Nope, this is just a fish. Interesting. No arrows either. And they're not like on the bricks in the foreground. They always seem to be in like background bricks, which is important. Or like at least a notable detail. I hear you, kitties. I hear you. This just spits me out here? Or where does it, where does this go? Okay, yeah, that's return, return to home. Uh, I mean, I guess I could go the other way and go to where the thing spits me out at where the other one spits me on it. I don't remember where that is. Uh, I might need to check it out. Safe while I'm here. Nothing down there. That's where the buttons were. There's a bunch of spikes up there. I think just get broken by the ostrich when it's going by. Ah, that's why the ostrich is gone. Right, he was in the, the wheel and he, he did. He did a dead. He did a died. Do I need the correct ability to... Get, turn this thing back on to be able to see the arrows in some other location. Is that what I'm missing? Is that the secret? Because yeah, I didn't. I I've already been here. I didn't see any arrows here. Fuck. Three out of five. They were here, here, and. Off to the left there, and here. And no other obvious locations. I looked here, I looked in, in this whole region here. I mean, I, I gave a good glance in here. I didn't, I don't think it was in there. Uh, it wasn't anywhere, it wasn't in this spot. It was, I, it wasn't, actually I didn't go over here yet. I should do that. Um, I didn't see it up here. Is, is it? Could there have been one in the kitty area and I didn't notice it? Like, where the freed kitties go? And, like, that's, like, the first sign? Like, one of the signals of, like, hey, you should use these codes in the kitties is that, um, it's present in that location. And you're like, oh, let me go try using this at the kitties. I will give that a shot. Uh, this is... I don't actually know where this goes. Oh, it goes all the way to the top. I don't want to go there. There's also that spot up there that I ha just haven't been able to get up to. And once again, I'm like, what am I missing? This, is this a, this, oh, this is a fan. This is a fan that I haven't figured out how to turn on. So probably I should do that. And if I do that, then that will let me get up to the thing up there. So it's not like I need some extra ability. I just need to turn on a fucking fan. Right. 
yeah, that is. That's a set of fans. So how do I do? How doth do that? Cool. Um. I feel like it would be in the same room, right? The switch would be in the same room. Yeah, it totally is. It's like it's submerged, but it's there. Yeah, the the switch would be at least the or semi. It'd be like co-located, roughly, because otherwise, how would you know that it turns on that switch? So there's got to be something that I'm missing in that spot. Oh, what if I? Really? I mean, I would have thought that it was that. Okay, um, nothing on the UV situation, nothing in the lantern situation. Just something in the map information? Sort of. Like, actually, is it a f I love it. The map tells you. The map actually has that info in there to show you. That's wild, though. It's all there. Like, you, you saw me. I was able to logic that out. Like, it made sense by just working through the details. There's a... And there's a kitty code. Great. Okay, so... Kitty codes all in this area confirmed. I need one more now. And they're always in secret areas. I don't know what the symbols are, uh, what that's about, but okay. So I, I'm so close. I'm so close. <laughs> okay, let's do a kitty freedom. Um. Wait, oh, probably the other kitty. It, or, or else I transcribed it wrong. And then there's like one more little secret spot that I haven't gotten to related to the kitty codes. This one, is it free this kitty? Cool. So, I need to find one more secret area. Hey, are you gonna leave? Are you gonna go? Oh, this one isn't leaving. Interesting. Um, give it the ball. Oh, now it's leaving. Oh, I, I guess I just had to, like, startle it. So, yeah. So there's one more secret that I have not uncovered in this region. Oh, and so I've got that tagged out now. Great. Um, I gotta get this. What? Let's see, I'm over an hour here. Okay. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna pause it here and I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna resume right away because I'm gonna keep going. Hooray!